Lewis Hamilton is one of the most famous and successful Formula One drivers. He holds the record for most wins, podiums, pole positions and points in the history of the competition, in addition to having won seven world titles. And just a few days ago he was announced as the new driver for Ferrari. But today we're gonna explore some curiosities you might not know about Lewis Hamilton's life that are worth knowing. From his passion for music to his choice of a vegan lifestyle. So buckle up as we start another episode of Hero's Journey. Lewis Hamilton is a British racing driver, considered by many as the greatest Formula One driver of all time. Born on January 7, 1985 in Stevenage, a small town near London, Lewis Hamilton came from a humble family. Despite being the highest paid driver today, he had a very poor childhood. As proof of his simple life, Hamilton used to sleep on a sofa bed in the living room due to lack of space. Meanwhile, his father worked three jobs to support the family. After his parents' separation, he lived with his mother until he was 12, and then moved in with his father and his stepmother. Although born in England, he has Caribbean roots through his father, who is from Granada, in Venezuela. Even then, recognizing his son talent, his father, Anthony Hamilton, always made efforts to invest the little resources he had in his son's career. That's how Hamilton's love for racing began in 1991, when his father bought him a remote-controlled car, and the following year the young driver competed and won the National Remote-Controlled Car Racing Championship, the BRCA. He even beat the adults competing in the same tournament. As we can see, he was always a prodigy. When he was just six years old, as a Christmas present, his father gave him a go-kart. And at just nine years old, in 1993, he started competing in kart races. His skill level on four wheels was so impressive that he stood out starkly from other competitors. Even though it's a more elitist sport, Lewis overcame his lack of resources with an abundance of talent performing perfect maneuvers and demonstrated refined technique for his young age. He quickly became the intercontinental champion in his category and won several championships during that period. But it was in 1998 that his paths opened up once and for all when Ron Dennis, the head of the McLaren team, called Hamilton and hired him for McLaren's driver development program. The contract included the option of a future seat in Formula One, which would make Hamilton the youngest driver ever to secure a contract with a right to a spot in the world's premier motorsport competition. After he started earning money from racing, Lewis always gave half of his earnings to his father, who was also his agent. However, this relationship was marked by fights and conflicts of interest. Until 2015, when their relationship seemed increasingly strained, Lewis thought it was best to professionally part ways with his father and sought a new manager to assist in his career. This difficult decision proved to be the right one, as over time, both were able to mend their family relationship and strengthen the emotional connection between father and son. Now returning to his sports trajectory, his brilliant Formula 1 career began at the end of 2006, when McLaren announced Hamilton in the team that would compete in the following season, alongside teammate Fernando Alonso. Lewis Hamilton made his debut in 2007, however, more than his debut on the track, this was also his debut on the podium. Right away, he secured third place in his first Grand Prix in Australia. During his debut season, Hamilton impressed everyone with his skill and consistency. He had four victories in Canada, United States, Hungary and Japan. In the final standings, the sports icon established himself as the runner-up of the year, competing closely for the title until the last race and losing the championship to Kimi Haikkonen, a Finnish driver from Ferrari by just one point. But it was in 2008 that Lewis Hamilton effectively achieved his first world title. The British driver became the Formula 1 world champion at just 23 years old, and thus he became the first black champion in the competition. That season he achieved the incredible feat of 5 victories, winning the Australian Grand Prix in Monaco, the United Kingdom, Germany and China. The good results and his excellent performance on the track led McLaren to renew his contract, extending it until 2012. 
However, this phase was also marked by tough battles and some defeats in our hero's life. Like ordinary people, our young driver also encountered problems along the way. In 2009, Lewis Hamilton had problems with a few rules and penalties of the category. With a car not well suited to the new rules, McLaren had one of its worst starts in Formula 1. As a result, the prodigy driver ended the competition in 5th place. Then 2010 was not a good year for the driver either. Hamilton also went through difficult times in his personal life. For example, an illness his father had and fights in his romantic relationship with the singer Nicole Scherzinger also affected his professional environment, causing him to lose focus, including getting involved in accidents on the tracks. When Lewis Hamilton finally returned to his full capabilities in 2012, it was McLaren that was going through a bad moment. Then, after some disagreements, after six years of partnership, Hamilton put an end to his relationship with the team. In total, Lewis Hamilton achieved 21 victories during his time at McLaren. And it was precisely in 2013 that the golden era for Hamilton began when he was transferred to the traditional Mercedes team. This change was considered risky at the time, but proved to be one of the wisest decisions of his career. Hamilton set impressive records during his career at Mercedes, including the highest number of wins, pole positions and podiums in Formula 1 history. To give you an idea of the dominance during this period, since the English driver arrived at the German team in 2013, he won 6 world titles. Being a huge fan of Ayrton Senna, one of the greatest drivers of all time, Lewis Hamilton achieved an unprecedented feat and surpassed the number of world titles of his idol in 2017. When he won his fourth world championship, while Senna won three world titles throughout his career, prematurely interrupted by a fatal accident during a race in 1994. His admiration for Senna is so great that he used a helmet for a long time in tribute to the Brazilian, with the image of Christ the Redeemer drawn on the back. Moreover, Hamilton has a legion of fans in Brazil, a relationship he has built over his career. Today, he is regarded as an idol by thousands of motorsport lovers in the country. The identification is so strong that he received the title of honorary citizen in 2020 by winning his seventh championship in an impressive race at the Turkish Grand Prix. Hamilton became statistically the most successful driver in the history of Formula 1 at that time. This was only possible because he managed to equal Michael Schumacher's record of seven world titles. But for the first time in history, a driver managed to surpass the number of wins and pole positions of the German. Until the beginning of the 2024 Formula 1 season, Lewis Hamilton has achieved a total of 103 victories in Grand Prix. And now, after 11 years of a successful partnership, his departure from Mercedes was announced at the end of the season. So at 39 years old, Hamilton had the courage to take on a new challenge in his career. He will represent the most famous Italian automobile company in 2025. Ferrari is the new home of the British driver for the next season. And the world of Formula 1 eagerly awaits the new chapters of his winning story. Do you think he will be able to win title number 8 and isolate himself as the leader of the greatest champions of all time? Well, only time will tell, but other curious facts about Hamilton's life also deserve attention. Lewis uses his prestige and popularity to spread messages of support to the Black Lives Matter movement on his social networks, showing its importance for the anti-racist struggle within one of the world's most elitist sports. Lewis Hamilton is also a great philanthropist and supporter of charity, as well as the founder of the Hamilton Commission, an organization dedicated to promoting diversity in the worlds of science, technology and engineering. Besides his political activism in defense of racial equality, from a young age he has always stood out as a defender of other important issues, such as sustainability, veganism and respect for animal rights. In fact, he also founded a vegan restaurant chain called Neat Burger. Another curious aspect of his personal life is his way of expressing himself through clothes. He's known for his unique and conscious style and fashion. He has collaborated with various brands and also launched his own clothing line called Tommy X Lewis. He's also a big fan of design and has worked with some companies to design items like watches and bicycles. His interest in the field of science and technology is so great that he dedicated himself to mechanical engineering at John Moores University in Liverpool. 
Another passion in his life is music. He has collaborated with various artists, including Christina Aguilera and Neo, and has also released a song titled Looking at You. Moreover, the driver has performed as a DJ at several events. Today, he plays the piano and sings. In fact, he has a fully equipped recording studio in his house. Some people might not know about this artistic aptitude of the driver, but Lewis Hamilton also had a brief stint in Hollywood. He voiced a character that bears his name in the Disney Pixar film Cars 2. In addition to voicing, he helped design the Lewis car for the film, making it exactly as he wanted it. And he seems to have enjoyed the world of screen so much that Hamilton is now helping to produce a film that will address the Formula One theme. The film, which is yet unnamed, is being made in partnership with Apple TV and will have Brad Pitt as the lead actor. Regarding his wealth, Hamilton has earned over $1.8 billion in his Formula One career and is considered one of the richest men in sports. He has invested in a lot of business outside of Formula One, including real estate and a clothing brand. In 2016, the British driver posted on his social networks a photo with his private jet. The aircraft was purchased in 2013 for 20 million pounds, but no longer belongs to the athlete. And you, did you know all these facts about our hero's victorious career? A driver who will forever be marked in history, not only for his sports achievements, but also for his good deeds. Now we want to know from you what stood out most in his career. And if you like this video, please leave a like so this content can reach more people. And if you want to continue discovering the journey of ordinary people who became real life heroes, please subscribe to our channel on Hero's Journey. I'll see you next time.